Alright, so we're finally here and we finished setting everything up for our move to Unreal, so this video will conclude the time management and self-improvement series. Truth be told, there's actually quite a few videos left on this topic that I didn't have time to cover, so maybe somewhere down the line I'll do another one of these types of series and talk about everything that I didn't get to cover this time. But I wanted to make sure that the closing video for this was important, useful, and meaningful. So up to this point we've talked about why your time is important and how to systematically plan to build your dreams, and the value of your thoughts. And there's one last major piece of the puzzle that I think really ties all of this stuff together in a very important and real-life practical way. Something that I really don't see a lot of people talk about. And that is overcoming the fear of making mistakes. This is actually something that comes up quite a lot when I talk to especially younger new indie developers or 3D artists or animators or really any up and coming aspiring content creators of any sort. It's like so many of these really incredibly talented young bloods that just have so many cool ideas are stuck or frozen and they just really don't want to make any kind of move unless they are a thousand percent sure that this is the best solution with the best software, with the best program, or whatever. It's like they're thinking, I'm not gonna do anything unless I know exactly what I'm doing. But the problem is you're not gonna know what you're doing until you do it. Like if your plan is, I'm only going to pursue my goal if I know I can do it correctly without making mistakes then yeah, you're never gonna pursue your goal. You're gonna stay frozen forever because you will always find a better way to do what you do tomorrow, even if you have the perfect solution yesterday. And you know, I thought long and hard as to why this crippling fear of making mistakes is so prevalent right now. And I have a few theories, but from the people that I've had these conversations with, I really think one of the main reasons this is so common is the fact that we now live in a world where mistakes are no longer tolerated. Everything you do or say needs to be 100% correct all the time, every time, because lo and behold, if you make a mistake, it's gonna be on the internet forever, in public, always. And there's virtually no such thing as an internet comeback. Most people are uncertain. Most people have no experience. Most people are not experts in their field. And the likelihood of f***ing up is basically guaranteed. So naturally, most people conclude, well I just won't do anything. And that way, I won't make any mistakes and I'll be okay. Which sounds like a good plan until you realize that's not real. Mistakes are a part of life. Mistakes are how people grow and mature. Success is literally built out of mistakes, and you should not be afraid of that. Now I'm not saying to go YOLO and be a careless idiot. I'm just saying if there's something that you really want to do, but for whatever reason you're afraid that you're gonna do it wrong, well, that's natural. In fact, that's a healthy, normal human response, and it signifies that you really care about doing the right thing, which is a good thing. And that is how every awesome anime starts, exactly where you are right now. All you gotta do is practice, do your research, look at the cards you're holding, make your best guess, and just play your hand. If it works, awesome. Ask yourself, how could you have done better? If it doesn't work, awesome. Figure out where you went wrong, and use this information to inform your next move. And that's it. So, I'll end this video with this. Just understand, you don't lose the game when you make mistakes. You lose the game by not learning from them. So don't be afraid, just do your best, and what happens happens. The only thing that matters is how you respond after it happens. So again, thank you so much for watching, and as always, hope you have a fantastic day, and I'll see you around.